People quite often ask us, why are we doing this? Why are we going on a cycling tour? Usually we have a counter question, why not? So here we present several reasons why you should never go on a cycling tour. People quite often tell us, you'll have to cycle on flat boring landscapes all the time, or have others put it quite persistently. Since you're not experienced in such ventures, it would be far too difficult to conquer some serious mountains and far too dangerous to cycle to remote places and landscapes. Some have tried warning us. You'll have to cycle 24-7 if you want to reach your goals. You'll be constantly exhausted. Since you'll always be on the road, there will be no time for yourself or to have a good rest. Not to mention other activities you might like to do or people you'd like to meet. People have tried to scare us. You'll cycle on busy, dangerous roads, continuously breathe exhaust fumes from old heavy trucks and be pushed off the road by crazy drivers daily. According to them, it is too difficult to find an alternative and quite often a more interesting route. And to go even further, there have been unsuccessful attempts to discourage us and some of them go like this. You lose all of your old friends. They can go on about their lives without you as easy as with you and you won't make any new real ones. Since the road is a lonely place, you'll end up feeling secluded and depressed. However, if you do end up going, the only transport you can use is your own bicycle. At least that's what we were told. But here we were, planning their adventure our own way. Your plans will change, and that's true. But if you do something you like, why not do it your way? Listening to people who have never done a long distance travel will sound roughly like this. It is extremely dangerous to go on a trip like that, especially to unknown places. You'll meet dangerous people everywhere who will try to rob you, use you and harm you. Whereas in fact, the most dangerous person that you might meet along the way, well, we've met so far, has been this guy. And if you're worried about style, please don't be worried about style. But it will be easy to rent you from going by saying that you look like you've just come out from a bad sitcom from the 80s after a wrestling match in the mud. <laughs> the truth is, there's no actual rules and you can dress as you please, as long as you feel comfortable in your own skin. One of the best reasons why you should not go on a bike tour is you will grow old and become ugly. Your experiences, misfortunes and fortunes will definitely show on you. As if people who didn't go on bike tours lived in time capsules? Well, you might even grow a beard and it's a fashionable thing to do these days. Just don't forget your sunblock and you'll be fine. Leave your makeup at home. But by far the scariest and possibly the most true point anyone has tried to make against traveling long term is that you'll never be the same again. Particularly since you never want to change, you never want to grow, you never want to become more aware about the world you live in. So think wisely, and whatever you do, do not go on a bike tour. You'll have a tale or two to tell of your own when you come back. Can you promise that I will come back? And if you do,